<rire> Hi, John. Annie. Hi, guys. <clears throat> From our little corner of paradise that is very rainy today. Good morning, Padasia. Hopefully, the weather will get nice again. But I think the forecast is like pretty bad today, lots of rain. But maybe we can go to the mall and get a massage and do some shopping. I will do the villa tour, guys, when I think I should do it when the weather is better. But we have some stuff to taste together. I woke up early, so I thought, hey, I can, everybody's still sleeping, so. My room is there. Christelle and Hervé are there. There is another room here. We have uh, the living room. Big pool that I use almost every day. It's a good exercise for me. We have the, the ocean over there. You can't really see, you can see, yeah, right? Sky, and that's the line of the ocean. Voila, that's the table outside, the kitchen. You can see already lots of food. That's all up. Well, it's a huge, huge, huge kitchen that we haven't used much yet because we eat outside a lot. That's our breakfast. We have uh, someone who sets up everything for us in the morning for our, our breakfast. The champagne glasses are waiting for us. <laughs> we haven't drank drunk the champagne yet because I think it's because the food is just so good here. I'm not putting too many lights, guys, because I like it like this. So we are going today to make, where is the box? This horrible, horrible, super smelly durian coffee. I wanted to try it yesterday. I did not because it just, oh my God, it's just so horrible. But I should, we should get a better angle. This is not good. I'm in such a nice place, but I'm giving you a shitty angle <laughs> with some green maybe. Ah, voila, this is nice. And I thought I can't do this. I have to do this with my friends because maybe I can drink this durian coffee only once in my life. So it's still in the cup. I just have to add some, when I covered it, this, oh, it stinks, guys. It stinks so, so much. Oh, oh, oh horrible, horrible. Hi, Jason. Well, we have a lot of powder. Horrible, horrible, horrible durian. Smells my sister. I was like, do you know durian? Have you tasted it before? And I'm like, I put the cup under their nose. They were like, this smells like toilets. It really smells rich, this one, let's say. It's a bag. Hi, Phil. You love Montefon, you love, yeah, it yes, it tastes rich. The smell is because how it's harvested, ah, okay. We will have to try and do a tasting with lots of durian products, plus the real fruit. That smells so much. When I saw it at the supermarket the other day, I was like, oh my God, this smells so horrible. Jason, if we have smell of vision, you will all stop watching this live stream because it's horrible. So I found this at Singapore's airport, if you remember well. Those who haven't watched the live stream, please check it out. We have 
six. Uh, hold on a second. How many packs? Two, four, six. Attend two, four, uh, eight packs. I'm not sure I'm ready. I think we have to taste other good stuff after this because maybe let me go and get the hot water. I think I will have to put something oishi in my mouth after we taste this. Let's go to the table. Oh no, maybe here if there is an accident. How have you been, guys? I need to put a clip on my nose. So I'm just going to pour the hot water, right? I think they said 150. This cup must be 150, and I think we want... <laughs> we want to, to dilute the thing. Oh my God, I've been breathing with my mouth. I have to breathe with, with my mouth, guys. This one is going to be a hard one, but actually it smells a little bit of coffee now. So maybe it's not that horrible. Maybe, hopefully it tastes of coffee. Don't throw up. Yeah, when they wake up, seriously, maybe I will be dead like a cockroach, was it? Attends, where I go is good. Here? Maybe, I don't hold on a second. First live stream. Hello, Anne. Hello, my dear. La, let's get the box. Up. This is slow morning, eh, guys. Ah, I still have some of my lemon water, which might help, guys if this smells like too horribly oh ah horrible horrible <laughs> horrible that's the real stuff guys is the angle okay yes ah i love the taste is similar to ripe apricot overripe pear sour grapes thank you because i can never this this um it's hard to describe this this horrible <laughs> smell. <laughs> voilà. Let's do it. Coffee durian. Guys, is... Because when I took the picture of in front of the supermarket, isn't this reverse? The, the image, please confirm. I have to check out my settings maybe. <laughs> the whole neighborhood is going to be I'm going to awake the whole neighborhood Bon Yes, gambali macho Jones Itadakimas Actually from close it doesn't taste that bad smell that bad or did I get used to it? It smell it smells like durian but also like coffee. Itadakimas. <laughs> durian. It doesn't it doesn't really taste like coffee. Hold on a second. Thank you, Libby. I have a very important announcement to make, guys. I can drink this stuff. This is not bad at all. No feel. This is good. <laughs> believe? Can you believe? I, ca I cannot believe myself that I'm saying this. Seriously? Guys, alors this is good, KB. My reactions are priceless. This is good that the taste, the smell makes me have 
these reactions because the taste, guys, I'm really surprised. It's like, you know, the powder coffee. Like some milk powder coffee. So it's, a, it's pretty mild. And we have, let's say, so I don't remember having tasting durian before, but can durian give a creamy texture? And I, to me, it's a little bit of a creamy taste. Like maybe it's because if, of that super ripe fruit um, smell and probably taste, but it's a light fruit, the light durian uh, taste. Café latte, powder café latte taste with a slight durian round taste. It's actually pretty good, I think. <sighs> Coffee with a toothpaste flavor. I can I suggest that to Kalidi Gregory and then they do not hire me anymore as a consultant. Um, I'm not going to, to give this away. I'm going to bring it back to Japan and maybe have, um, I should have Shinichi taste this because he will be interested and Shichi and Satoshi would be interested in tasting this, I think. And they will not hate me because I think this is good. Um, what was it Mr. Lim at the airport? Do you remember guys? I think it was Mr. Lim. He said, this is good, this is good, but you know, Singapore people, they love durian. So maybe they think all of the stuff is good, but he said, no, he said, good, uh, good taste. And this was a really good um, recommendation. So now we have to taste the biscuits, the cakes he had me taste. Huh? So guys, if you find this and want to discover durian or if you, you're a durian lover, you will like this. It's very good. It smells really badly. But the taste is good. And now it doesn't smell anymore to me now that I'm drinking it. Well, it does smell bad. <laughs> you get used to it after five minutes. Mm, this is nice. Alors, how many days? I live on Friday morning, guys. So less than a week now. I don't want to think about it because it makes me sad. And like my sister and Hervé, every single day, they are like, oh my God, we don't have so much time. Stop saying that, guys. Come on, we have to enjoy every day. And we still have plenty of days. But like, it's been three days, they're like, oh my God, we don't have time anymore. And I'm like, oh, you know. High track. Guys, let's try. Crystal opened the mango tarts. We bought those three, three products. The live went down when I was live streaming in Singapore at the airport. But this is the three products we bought from Mr. Lim, right? Right, Montefon, we have to do not think about those things because then you enjoy less, right? By the way, this is first breakfast. I have to message my friend, I don't know. This, it's not pouring that much now. Maybe we can go to Peter's, the road less traveled, to have our, my second breakfast. He, he, he makes super good um, coffee. Attends. I have to tell my friends, guys, we are having breakfast together, you know me. Slow. And I'm not getting many views on the... Um, on the Itai things. People, they love Japan, but they should love Koh Samui too. Oh, 
Okay, this. <laughs> Guys, I have to, I haven't put on makeup in a few days. Lola love, hello. I had to put a little bit on my eyes because I have to make a video to introduce a product because we have this monthly gathering at Kalti and we introduce our, the products we've developed to the top, you know, like the, the women who take care of many stores, Kalti stores. And it's happening on the 4th of uh, December, but I'm here. So I'm going to make a video. I don't know if the words in Japanese are going to pop out. Thank you so much, Phil. Voila, mm, smells good. Mango, small pies. Crystal said it was good. I believe it's good. She opened it two days ago. It's going down fast. Let's try one. Tadakimas. Mm. Oh, oh, smells sweet. If I didn't know it's mango, I, maybe I could, wouldn't be able to say mango, but it smells like fruit and pie. Mm. Tadakimas. You have some fresh mango inside. Hi, Tipper. Thank you. Yes, I'm so relaxed. Kosamu is doing me so good. We are eating so healthy. And like I'm exercising every day, trying not to work, only in the morning a little bit, you know? And when I'm tired, it's good tiredness, right? And I can see even myself, I see my face every morning I've seen my face in the mirror and I'm like, oh my God, I look healthier and healthier. My skin is cleaner, I think. So I need more massages until we leave. This is very good, guys. Now. Mm, yes, it tastes of mango. Maybe a little bit of orange too, not sure. Or they add sugar, which makes it mm. with flour, margarine, corn flour, mango, egg, mango flavor, sugar, salt. This is nice. Feel, I bet that when I go to Australia, I will look healthy too. Mm. This one is nice. I will have, I think I might, I'm not sure because you know, I'm trying not to, I'm trying to enjoy this holiday. So I think we will do a suitcase and packing when I get back, back home and you see all the stuff I've bought. Oh my God. Oh, I have a, remind me, I have, we have a present to open. I got a present. I don't know what it is. I have to open it with you guys. Let's open the pineapple tarts. I'll be a Bondi bitch, babe. <laughs> no, bitch. <laughs> I have to be careful in between the, those two bitch words. I'll be a Bondi bitch, bitch, babe. <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, starting the jokes already. How are you, Anne? Are you, what time is it in Norway? Seriously, guys, I don't know what time it's in France nor in Japan. My pet sitter hasn't texted me yet, so I think it's probably morning still. Can I open this? Ah, yes. Track, it's your birthday? <gasps> Joyeux anniversaire. Joyeux anniversaire, Trek Boy. Joyeux anniversaire, Trek Boy. Joyeux anniversaire. Mwah, 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 mwah. Bisous and joy. What time is it, Trek? 
Bond I. Bond I. Bond is pronounced Bond I. Wow. Bond I. When was it, Trek? Sorry, I've been so off. I'm even off from Patreon, guys. So the question is, Patreon Peter, Patreon Peter says it's okay to do the food tasting when I get back. So that would be next weekend. Would you be okay with that? Phil, Anne? Oh my God, it's so humid. I don't know how to use those, where the button is to use those ventilators. Or I'll just do maybe a short one and then track, are you, would you be agree with me with doing the tasting when we get back home? I'll do probably a short one, a private one for you guys, but thank you, Jason. Okay. Oh, seriously? It's so hot all of a sudden. Let me get a towel. This is Thailand. Huh? So sometimes, you know, it's like, it's that we, we've been lucky because we have the breeze, but sometimes all of a sudden it gets so... Ah. <laughs> it gets so hot, right? It's so humid. It's heavy. I don't know. And I couldn't do the video, you know, for Caldi to introduce my product. Shoot, I can't open this thing, why? This is annoying. Uh, because with the rain, it was so noisy. What the hell? And I don't want to spoil my nails. I did um, had the nail thing. Shoot. Knife. Ah, well, okay. Ah, I understand now. There is more. Oh my God, they put two. Ah, this is super sealed, guys. I understand now. I have to take you also around this place because it's a, we are in a resort. Yes, more tape. Oh, shoot. Oh la la. Island life. More tape, yes. Um, so we are, the villa is located, yes, I know, and this is why I, I, I took this angle. There are other villas, we, we are renting the biggest one. Luxury, guys. We have, I said, hey, you know, let's not be picky. It's, we haven't, I, ha I don't even remember last time I took a real holiday, guys. That was probably more than 10, 10 years ago. The rolling eye person is still sleeping. And then there are smaller villas that are just so nice. Uh, I started also, guys, believe it or not, looking out, checking out properties. Yes, because we don't know. But there are really nice villas here to buy and you know maybe i can think of renting such a place not sure seriously when i do the video i'll be like i and i can't i was thinking i can't do the video with the palm trees you're like hey ah how you ah you know some community well and you know so he will do no go no they will be like jennifer you're not working you're on holidays in thailand so i will do you think this corner, is it too much? Like, oh my God, she's on holiday. Okay, let's try the pineapple thing, it's open. Mr. Lim said there was fresh uh, pineapple, the fruit inside. Tadakimasu. Smells, ah, Crystal. <laughs> I could see the cur curtains. Tadakimasu, guys. Mm. Mm, it smells good. Mm. Mr. Lim recommended this more. It's more like handmade. Can you see the texture of the pie? Lots of flesh. 
Which one is better? To me, this one is fresher. Tastes more like handmade. Mm. But I like mango too. So the mango one is good too, but more sugary. Mm. You can see guys the texture. I'm going to show you both again. Both are good, but at this one more natural, fresher, like more handmade like. But maybe it's just, you know, because the texture is so different. So it makes it like it's more handmade, but the ingredients are similar, guys. We have some eggs in here. Mm. They don't add so much unless they don't read it. Not sure. Maybe the regulation is different in Singapore, but this is more like um, this is more like how to say ça c'est feuilleté, and this one is more like you know the crumbling thing like a shortbread. Not sure I'm explaining. It's hard for me to explain properly in English, but ça c'est plus feuilleté, et ça ça fait plus pas de brisé. If someone understands French. Did you, Ala Pete says, did you hear that in Italy some towns who are selling home for less than 100 euro? Oh my God, really? Then we can do both guys, to repopulate their towns that are turning to ghost town. Wow. Because then guys, I can organize the gourmet tours in Koh Samui, but also in Italy, right? What's my favorite Thai dish? The mango, yes, Tom Yum is super good too. The yesterday, guys, I have to ask what this vegetable is. Because we ate at the villa for the first time and we had had, I love how, the, how they pack things, guys. They are just so good. I might do a what's in my fridge at my friend's place. <laughs> I like that. It's so smart how they pack it. I don't know what this vegetable is, but it's the in the owner's garden and they put some kind of egg. See how smart they pack it? Super easy to open and bam. And it was still warm when we took it back track. I should so live here, that's for sure. The coconut rice that we don't didn't even open because we also bought some chicken rice. But I love how they do things, just so smart and so delicious. And I have to tell you also why I'm being so... I f have more and more energy, of course the environment, sports every day but the food guys do you know why because we are not we are not eating all those processed foods that's why it's all natural so no you know preservatives etc i feel healthier and healthier i have to come back to to go somewhere and spend more time you know, like, I think I should come to Koh Samui. If I could come every two months, that would be amazing for 10 days. I would be rejuvenated, that's for sure. In Italy, I think it would be good for my health too. I would be, maybe I would get fat because this was even better, guys, with the kitchen and the... Where the food is good, usually I'm happy, but in Thailand, the thing is that we eat so much fruits and vegetables. I do, right? Um, so I get all the vitamins naturally. You don't need to intake supplements, I think, in Thailand because you get it from the fruits and vegetables. Hundreds of years, houses. 
I will try and Google it. Four taste tamarind. We can try that and then I will leave you guys because Crystal is probably going to come down. Fat, alors, the Cote, Cote Kino, seriously, it's so good. But indeed, we shouldn't have it too much. Let's try this thing. It has the taste, the, the shape of the, of the fruit. Yeah, but then, you know, if you buy, Pete, if you buy something in bad shape, if you buy it for 100 euros, then maybe it will cost you 30,000 euros. Ooh, wow, that doesn't look good. <laughs> but, you know, when you buy a house, you can't have a house for less than 100,000 or 200,000, so. Not sure what this is. Itadakimasu. Oh, it smells good. Ah, this is the fruit. Mmm. Is it spicy, this thing? It has a small... Wow, this is spicy. Ah, four taste tamarind. So maybe... Oh, shoot. That will wake me up. If someone can translate. It's so difficult to speak Thai, guys. At last we know how to say thank you and hello, but... Um, with 30k, I could buy a house in Nagano, but then I would have to add a hundred thousand no let's say eighty eighty thousand euros let's say eighty to ninety back thousand bucks to have it repaired so hard so this italian deal would be good i think voila voila guys the weather is seems to be getting better maybe i can do this video for this tamarind thing, I haven't eluded the mystery. I hear this is a fruit. Oh. Thai people are such beautiful people. Seriously, here we were talking with Crystal and Hervé yesterday. The service, guys. And they are just so smiling all the time and just it's so nice here. And we get you get great service wherever you go to a small like eatery or of course if you go. But sometimes, you know, in France, you go to posh places, you don't get such a good service. Some people are just like, oh, you know, the French attitude. The land of smiles, yes. In Japan, I was explaining them that it used to be perfect. Now, with all the people doing the small jobs, the young people, the quality of service in Japan is getting down. Let me try this uh, cafe. It's good. Um, I hope that Japan is not going to change too much because that would be a pity. I'm going to show you a little bit around because it's better now. Rarely to catch a yes, Pete. This is true. I think this is. Have you? Have I ever seen you commenting live? I have, didn't open my present, guys. Did you notice, Phil? Would you feel self-traveling to Koh Samui solo? Oh, yes. Absolutely. 
Of course, I would be careful of not walking alone in dark places in the evening. But during the day, oh yeah. People don't seem to, what I think is good is that I don't feel like a tourist here. And it might actually be the only country I've traveled to, I mean in Asia. I don't feel like a tourist. I feel like, okay, I'm, I'm a foreigner, like I could be a, a, a Thai person. People live in harmony, I have the feeling here. Well, that's our view. There is another villa here, but what is good is that all the villas are separated by the green, so we don't see each other. Voila! Alors, let's open our present, guys. Let's see. What did I get? Up. I got the present in this, in this beautiful, beautiful kawaii bag. That is going to be convenient as an eco bag, right? Voila, oh, kawaii. No, I'm not breakable, I think. Christmas. Every day is Christmas when you're in Koh Samui and staying where I'm staying, guys. I will put, of course, all the information when as, at the end of my trip. I will do a proper tour of the villa, try and show you also the area. You might want to rent this place or one of the small villas because it's super nice. You know that usually if, when Jennifer says it's good, you know that it's good, right? <gasps> Nani! What is this? Kawaii! My color, my kind of color, I think. Kawaii! T-shirt! So nice! Kawaii! Very good, thank you to my friend who bought me this. Thank you so much. I opened it, I can wear it now. Tomorrow I will wear it. So kawaii. Voila, I say this is a ni nice start for the day. I'm going to leave you guys, do that video for Kaldi and then maybe I go to have, not sure because I feel full now but maybe I can just go and have just coffee at uh, Peter's. Voila, thank you, Phil. Thank you, guys. Uh, not sure when I will live, live stream next. I'm not sure about the weather either uh, we, because we're going to visit the, what they call the um, Big Buddha. Ah, hopefully it will not be raining. And I thought I might live stream this Maybe the weather gets better afterwards. <sighs> Bob, do not ask me to pronounce that. <laughs> Impossible. Thank you so much. Drinkable durian coffee. Uh, no, we haven't hired a car. We should, we could have, but I have, um, we've had, we've used taxi. We can ask also the resort has organized cars for us. And also I have a friend uh, who's here. So sometimes she, 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 she's doing stuff with us. But when we have to go around by on our own, um, Christelle and Hervé were tempted to rent a scooter. We've been advised not to do it because there are many, many accidents um, of people driving the scooters. If you're not used to the traffic here, you shouldn't use a scooter. 
um, nor a bicycle. We don't see so many. And yeah, I think in every country, scooters can be dangerous, right? Uh, but then it's super well organized because what is good here is that, you know, when you're abroad, you, you take the taxi, don't you have the feeling that you, people are always trying to get more money from you? Um, which is the case because we have more means than the average salary here is 300 bucks, guys. You know, so this is nothing for us, right? I mean, for someone who has a normal salary in, in a Western country. But it's not okay. When I was on mainland in Thailand, one would say 500, 500 baht, the other one would say 1,000 baht. Uh, here, you have everything written. It's fixed. So you know what to expect, which is, I think, a super good thing. Uh, um, to me, Koh Samui, there is Thailand, the mainland, and there is Koh Samui. And in Koh Samui, as I said, I don't feel like a tourist. I feel like that we mingled in right away. This is why I like the place so much, and I think we all like the place so much. And we are thinking, how can we come back and spend more time here? Um, I have to see because, you know, with my gourmet tours, that's maybe something I could do in Koh Samui too, right? Please look at those cheap houses. I will try, try and uh, check this out when I go back to Japan. Voilà, voilà. Merci beaucoup, guys. And I will uh, live stream when I can, okay? Merci, Bob, uh, Phil, Jason, Anne. I don't know if you're still up. You should sleep, my dear. Um, Trek, see you soon. Uh, uh, and I will keep you posted if I do a short live stream on Patreon or not, okay? Voilà, voilà. Bisous, guys. See you very, very soon. With I leave you with the view without the rain now. Perfect. Cosmin, thank you so much. Yes, shopping this afternoon, probably. Massage, that's for sure, because I didn't have one yesterday. Thank you so much for the chip in. Now I feel like going into the pool. Thank you. Bye, guys. Love you. Bye.